The concept of hydraulic systems is straightforward. At first glance, it may seem complicated. However, if we break it down to the sum of its parts, it is a simple concept. After all, the first ever manned flight was cutting-edge technology at the time. Looking back, it seems rudimentary. First, we will discuss how our body has its own form of hydraulic system. Then we will discuss how hydraulic issues can be prevented. Finally, we will go over the consequences of hydraulics being compromised. Our own body has a hydraulic system. It takes the form of the circulatory system. As featured in Figure 1, the heart pumps fluid throughout the body. Our blood is under pressure from the heart performing as a pump, just as a hydraulic pump creates hydraulic pressure in the fluid. If I may draw your attention to Figure 2, think of a linear actuator as a muscle. The fluid feeds the actuator the power it needs to perform the task it was designed to do. Much like blood feeding a muscle, Figure 3 drives this point even further. Think of the red line being the artery, sending the fluid to the driving force, and the blue being a vein bringing the fluid back to the pump. Hydraulic issues can be prevented. Four major instances of contamination are particles, air, water, and chemical. The reasoning behind why these contaminants are unwelcomed are outlined here. Best rule of thumb to consider, if it is not hydraulic fluid, then it does not belong in the system. Combating these contaminants is covered through mitigation. Though it is impossible to eliminate all contaminants, it's important to keep them at an acceptable level. Changing and monitoring the air filter for the pump is critical for mitigation. Also, monitoring fluid levels, viscosity, and overall condition will aid in ensuring quality. Hydraulic failure is an issue the aviation industry faces today. This issue is more common than it should be. If systems are not maintained properly, catastrophic failure can occur. The consequences of a failed hydraulic system can be dire. Depicted in Figure 4 is March Airfield Reserve Base in California. The pilot lost control of the aircraft due to a catastrophic hydraulic failure. Thankfully, the pilot was able to eject to safety before the F-16 aircraft crashed into a warehouse just outside the base. With no serious injuries reported, this situation could have been so much worse. The concept of hydraulic systems is straightforward. At first glance, it seemed complicated. However, we broke it down and made it simple. First, we discussed how our body has its own form of hydraulic system, the circulatory system. Then, we discussed how hydraulic issues can be prevented. Finally, we went over the consequences of hydraulics being compromised. Through understanding of an issue, we are better equipped to solve the problem. Until next time, over and out.